Hey guys, what's going on? It's me, your boy, Muscle God, Samson Biggs, the Muscle God turned trading God. <laughs> anyway, Tesla is down big today. Tesla is falling. Um, it's down uh, over 11% today. And Tesla's been struggling. And... Uh, it's 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 really easy to know why Tesla is struggling. Tesla is struggling because of its uh, of of Elon Musk. Let's just be honest. Let's just call it what it is. Elon Musk is not uh, well. He's good for volatility. We'll say that he's good for volatility. What is volatility? For some of you guys that don't know what volatility is. Whether the stock goes up and down, swings like you know, uh, you know, there's stable and then there's volatile, right? So uh, that's what that's what Elon Musk is, is 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 good for volatility, but he's bad for the stability of the stock. Let's go ahead and look at the stock right now, cause uh, um, you know, might as well. You guys don't want to see my muscles right now. You, you look at my muscles later. Let's look at the stock. Well, that's not the one we want to go with. Let's go with this right here. Boom. Okay. So uh, let's just move this back a little bit so we can see where we're at. So Tesla is at about uh, $216 a share. And if you look right here, uh, it was it was up to about 260 to 65 It fell down to 216 And if you look, the last one, two, three, four earnings have been misses. Um, the, here's the thing about Tesla, and this is this is why, why Elon Musk is. Uh, I mean, uh, uh, this is just my opinion, but look it, right? Elon Musk, prior to him coming very public and showing his right wingness, a lot of people didn't really understand Elon Musk's right wingness before he took over Twitter before he took over Twitter you know he was Elon Musk from PayPal you didn't really know too much about him but you you, you know so Elon Musk right turns out to be this right wing douche bag and the problem is the customers for Tesla the real customers for Tesla are liberal hippies it just doesn't it just doesn't go well it just just doesn't doesn't melt doesn't it does just doesn't work right you got liberal hippies are the electro the, the people who want to buy electric cars liberal hippies right progressives liberals right these uh uh uh, uh these people that that Elon Musk make fun of these people that right wings hate on, right? Right wing people, they drive trucks, right? And not cyber trucks. <laughs> they don't want to drive cyber trucks. They want to drive big old Fords. They want to drive big old gas guzzling trucks. You know, the trucks that, that can't fit in the lane. You know what I'm talking about. That's Elon's fanboy. Elon's fanboy is, well, you got the stock market bros, right? The stock market bros love Elon Musk. But a lot of the stock market bros are not buying Teslas. Some of them are. Some of them are. But Tesla's main, main, main customer is hippie electric car people. Right? And then when Elon Musk comes out and opens his mouth, he just offends everybody. He's just offensive. Right, we know he's racist, but now on top of that, we know he's super bigoted. He just came out with a video a couple of days ago about how he's kind of disowning his his trans daughter. Right. So something to the uh, uh, I'm not even going to go into what he said, but I mean I feel sorry for his trans daughter. You know, uh, I mean. So that could be another reason why the stock is tanking. But 
he a- he's alienated his his core audience. And so what do you do with your core oh, your core audience? They say, you know what? I'm not going to drive a Tesla. There's competition out there. I can just go buy a- another car, another electric company, right? Starting to see a lot of Rivians on the road. Starting to see more and more Lucids on the road. But not just Lucid or Rivian. You know, you got uh, 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 Hyundai. They got a, a pretty good electric car. I drive a, um, uh, 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 a Hyundai Hybrid for my work job. Every day. It's uh, And there, what's, there's another, there's another uh, a Ford electric car. So you got all these hybrids, you got all these electric, you got all this competition, and it used to be cool. Oh, let's just drive a, a Tesla is really cool. But that was before you knew about <laughs> that was before you knew about Elon Musk's politics. Once you found out about Elon Musk's politics, you're like, I'm not going to drive a Tesla. I'm going to drive something else. <laughs> you know, hey, people are people. And, and and if you offend them, right? You know, it is what it is. I mean, look at all these stocks that are going down because of their their uh, uh, pro Israel stance, right? Starbucks being boycotted, you know, McDonald's being boycotted, you know, Tesla again, Tesla's being boycotted, uh, not uh, not necessarily. Well, maybe a little bit because of. Of, of Elon Musk and his little, you know, pro-Israel stance. But it's mostly because he's just a right-wing douchebag. And he's freaking, uh, um, <laughs> he's just alienating all of his liberal customers. Because that's, you guys, let's just be real. It's the liberals who buy electric cars. It's not the, it's not the right-wingers, Right. So yeah, is, is is Tesla a buy? I'm not gonna say it is or isn't. You guys are gonna have to make your own decision. Um, I'm not buying Tesla. I got out of Tesla, um, and uh, you know, if I see an opportunity to make money off of Tesla, I'll do it. You know, I'm a, I'm a, you know I'm not saying I'm not gonna make money off Tesla. You know, if if I can see if I see an opportunity, you know. And, and making some money off Tesla, I'll definitely take it. You know, but I'm not. I'm not a fan of Tesla. You know, I mean, their cars are cool, but you know, their mat, their their owner is is just super douche. You know, but what are you gonna do? It's your boy Samson Biggs. Just had to come on here and tell you what's going on in the stock market. So yeah, it's pretty pretty brutal day for a lot of people. Stocks are, are down today, but as you know, with the stock market goes up and down, so maybe tomorrow will be a green day. Maybe the next day will be another red day. Who knows? Or maybe we're getting into a bear market. It seems like the stock market is starting to turn over, but I'll let you guys know if the stock market does turn over. Um, for now, my my dividends are still paying, and uh, as long as my dividends are still paying, I'm a happy camper. So, all right. We'll see you on the next video.